passport to a forever home. That's the theme of the Connecticut Humane Society's first annual fall gala. Here to fill us in are Priscilla Clark, the development specialist at the Connecticut Humane Society, and Alicia Wright, the public relations director. Welcome, ladies. Thanks for coming Thank in. Thank you. Thanks for having us. All right, who do we have here stealing the show? Well, this is S'mores. <laughs> Tell us about S'mores. S'mores is a 10-year-old Boston Terrier mix, and he is looking for a new family. And he seems very friendly, would get along with dogs, other dogs? He's very polite at the shelter with the other pets. He can go home with families that have children as young as five. He's very well-mannered, but he does have an active side, so he still is going to enjoy plenty of playtime if you offer it. All right, very good. Let's talk about the mission of the Connecticut Humane Society. Yes, we are, we are the leading resource in the state for um, animal welfare placing adoptable pets like s'mores into new homes, helping the community with re reduced fee veterinary care, dog training services. Um, so we have a lot of really wonderful things going on uh, throughout the state at the Connecticut Humane Society. And it's not just dogs? No, not just dogs. We help cats, of course, many, many cats. Mm -hmm. And we also help a lot of small animals like your rabbits and guinea pigs and ferrets and birds. We actually have some birds available for adoption right now. Okay, let's put up some pictures. That's uh, the just give us kind of an overview of some of the animals that are there. Oh, look at this little cat. All these animals need homes? Yes, they do. All right. Um, Priscilla, let's get on to the party. Everyone likes a good party, right? Definitely. Uh, this is the first annual gala. Yes, our first annual fall gala. And uh, we are mm -hmm. November 16th in uh, Westport at the Inn at Longshore. Okay. And we are so excited because it's going to be a fun evening. It's going to celebrate the work that we do, that everyone at our three shelters do across the state. And uh, besides the fact everyone's going to have a great time, Broadway performers entertaining, um, auctions, Is this a fancy evening? Dinner. What are we wearing to this? We, we're going to get pretty fancy. Okay. This is black tie <laughs> optional, so we are encouraging black tie. Very good. All right, I also want to know about the Humanitarian Award that's going to be presented that night. Yes, we have actually created uh, the uh, Gertrude O. Lewis Humanitarian Award, named after our founder, and this year we are honoring um, uh, actress and shelter pet advocate Mary Tyler Moore. Very good. With our award, we are so excited that she'll be there with us that evening That's and great. Uh, to celebrate uh, the work she's done with her Broadway Barks organization uh, with Bernadette Peters. They're on 14 years of helping shelter dogs in New York City and we wanted to uh, bring that to light and really thank Mary Tyler Moore for all the good work she does. I like that. How much are tickets? Tickets start at 250 a piece and uh, for this fantastic evening. Great. We also have advertising opportunities, sponsorship opportunities. Companies can offer a donation of fantastic items to our live and silent auctions. Plenty of ways to get involved. All right, let's put some information up on the screen. It's the Connecticut Humane Society's first annual fall gala, Passport to a Forever Home. It's happening on Friday, November 16th at the Inn at Longshore in Westport. For tickets or more information, go to the cthumane.org cthumane.org for more information. And of course, we'll have information over on WTNH.com. And if we want to adopt s'mores, come on down to the Connecticut Humane Society today. He is currently available. He's a hot yes. item. He's going to go quickly. All right, ladies, thank you so much. Best of luck thank with the you. gala and stay with us. More Connecticut style after the break. We'll be right back.